from the Sunshine State, Florida, home of Dutyville, USA, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, here he is, Buffalo Bob Smith. <laughs> and dads tell me what time is it okay gang let's go it's howdy duty time it's howdy duty time bob smith and howdy do say howdy do Well, hiya, howdy. Oh, well, hi, Buffalo Bob, and hi, Peanuts. Hi, howdy. Well, howdy and Peanuts, today's show is going to be a Howdy Doody song fest. And I've worked out what I hope will be a nice program here. And you know, Howdy, I thought that in addition to games and all kinds of fun, uh, maybe we could sing lots of songs. Oh, boy, that I, sounds great, Bob. And uh, since I'm going to be conducting all the songs, it naturally, it means that I'm going to be out here on my feet throughout the show. I just hope the old legs hold out, you know? And I, hi, Clarabel. I, you mean that chair's for me? So I can sit down while I'm conducting. Sitting hey, down. That's a great idea. Hey. Because you can take a load off your feet. Yeah. Oh. Hey, thanks. I think. <laughs> uh, very considerate of you, Clarabel. You're a fine clown. Now, look. Come backstage with me, and we'll tell the gang what they're all supposed to do. Uh, take over, Howdy. Look, there's a couple of numbers. Well, that boys I got. and girls and moms and dads, the first song we're going to sing today is a little Whee! song called. Hee 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 uh -huh. How come nobody put a chair out here for me? I get tired too, you know. Yeah, well, Sandy, you, you see, you can always sit on your broom. Well, a broom is okay for flying around, but, man, to sit on it all day is pretty uncomfortable. Yeah, I suppose. Have you ever tried sitting on a broom handle for an hour? Well, no, I haven't. Well, but... take my advice. Yeah? Don't. Okay. Now, kid, go get me a chair. Uh, well, look, Sandy, I'm sorry, but... Well, I have other things to do. Oh, I have other... Th well, silly won't even let me sit in a chair during the show like Buffalo Bob. Well, if I can't sit comfortably, then neither will the old buffalo. I'll wiggle-waggle my broom and cast a spell on that chair, and no one will be able to sit on it. Just watch this, kids. If a chair for Sandra is not permittable, then this spell will make that chair unsittable. There! That ought to do it. <laughs> man, oh man, wait till you see the fun we're going to have every time someone tries to sit on this chair. So don't go away, Peanuts. We'll be right back. <laughs> sits on it is gonna have a big surprise. Yes, sirree. <laughs> well, I'm gonna watch the fun from up there. You know, a bird's eye view. See you later. Whee! Oh, 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 boy. Oh, boy, Bob. Oh, oh, Buffalo Bob's gonna let me sing one of the oldies. Save your pennies. Oh, why should I save my pennies? Are you gonna charge me money to hear you sing? Oh, no, no, silly. Save Your Pennies is the name of the song I'm going to sing. Oh, oh, it's a great tune. I see. Yeah. Hey, how is your song, Flob? Oh, it's delicious. 
Oh, come on. How can a song be delicious? <laughs> Easy. When a song is meatballs and spaghetti. <laughs> oh, say, Dooley Dolly, what's that chair for? Oh, oh, that? Oh, Carabelle brought that out for Buffalo Bob to sit in when he gets tired. Oh, I see. Oh. oh, hi there, Jackie Danish. Uh, uh, flub, flub a doob. Listen, my name is Davis. And that's what I want you to call me, Davis. Uh, okay, Davis Danish, but I like the name Jackie better. I give up. Say, look, Fub, uh, we doodlers are all set to play the song fest. Has anybody seen Buffalo Bob? Oh, he's backstage, but he'll be out soon. Oh, well, that's great. Listen, I'm so tired. I've been on my feet all morning, you know, rehearsing the group and everything. Why don't you sit down in Buffalo Bob's chair? Over here? Oh, yeah, I'm sure Buffalo oh. Bob wouldn't mind. Thanks, fellas. I certainly will do that. Uh, see, I've been staring all day inside. Oh! Haunted chair? Haunted chair? Man, I guess it's, uh, it's just my imagination, man. It looks like an ordinary chair to me. It's not just... I certainly wish that Buffalo Bob would come on, man, because I got to talk to him about... Uh, let me try it again. I don't really think. I think it's just my imagination. It's... Sure, it's just my imagination. You know, sometimes your imagination can play great tricks on your mind. And believe me... Oh! Well, listen, that is not my imagination playing great tricks on my mind. That's Oh, uh, hi, else. Jackie. Hi, Bob. Uh, Dilly said you were waiting to talk to me. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's that's right. Uh, say, yeah. uh, Bob, Bob. Yeah. Uh, uh, why, why, uh, why don't you have a seat here? Why well, I can't now, Jackie. First, I have to conduct a song. No, well... And I... What? Well, but listen, here's what happens. You're what? supposed to conduct a song sitting down. If yeah, well, I, I, I know it. I will. But you see, yeah. I can't do this one sitting down. This is the knock-knock song, and yeah. I have to do it over there at the peanut gallery. Yeah, do, yeah, do, and then yeah. afterward, I'll come back and sit in the chair for the rest of the show, okay? Well, sit in the chair. All right, now. <laughs> that's what he thinks. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Say, kids, wasn't that funny when Jackie Davis sat on the chair? <laughs> Man, I can't wait until Buffalo Bob tries it. Meanwhile, let's get this knock-knock song over with. I'm all alone inside my house. I'm being quiet like a mouse. Outside it's dark and though it's late, a stranger's walking through my gate. Ha, the stranger's at my door, I tiptoe softly across the floor. The clock is whispering, tock, tock, I think I hear a big knock, knock. Who's going to be first with a knock, knock? Who has a knock, knock? Anybody around here has a knock, knock? You have one, hun? What's your name? Beth Frankel. Okay, Beth, give me your knock knock. Knock knock. Who's there? Irish. Irish. Irish who? I wish I could be on Howdy Duty all the time. Oh, <laughs> is that cute? All right, thank you, Beth. Okay, now this little fella had his hand up. Uh, give me your. What is your name first? Dicky. Dicky. What's your knock knock, Dicky? Knock knock. Who's there? Shella. Shella. Shella who? <laughs> Is that right, Mother? No. <laughs> How's it supposed to go? Huh? Knock, knock. Who's there? You. You who? Me, he, for you, who. <laughs> me, he, for you, who. Or me, he, for you, who, too, who. Thank you, who. Now, okay, Abby. Uh, knock, knock, that was fun. These knock, knocks are for everyone. There must be one I'm waiting for. Who else is knocking at my door? Say, uh, do you have a little knock, knock here? Yes. Okay, what's your name? Elizabeth. Okay, Elizabeth, let's hear your knock knock. Knock knock. Who's there? Apple. Apple who? Knock knock. Who's there? Apple. Apple who? Knock knock. Who's there? Apple. Apple who? Knock knock. Who's there? Orange. Orange who? Aren't you glad I didn't say apple? I sure am. Wasn't that a great knock knock? Now that knock knock was really great, the kind that we appreciate. You could become a laughing stock. I'm waiting for another knock. Who might have a knock over here? Another knock knock. Do you have one? What's what's your name? Eric. Eric, what's your knock knock? Go say knock knock. Knock knock. Who's there? Buffalo Bob. Well, Buffalo Bob who? 
Buffalo Bob Smith. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, that's a new one on me. All right, honey, your hand was up. What do you have, sweetie? Knock, knock. Who's there? Pencil. Pencil who? Pencil fall down if you don't wear suspenders. Pencil, and then you know something? They will, too. That's good. That's all for now. It's time to go. We could play this game throughout the show. In fact, we could play it round the clock. Cause it's always fun to play. Knock, knock. Oh, save a full bob. Yep. Those peanuts sure did tell some funny knock knocks. Yeah, they did. Yeah. Uh, howdy, do me a favor, would you please? Uh, would you go backstage and tell Dilly that we should be ready for his number in, oh, say, two or three minutes, okay? Oh, oh sure, Bob. Thank you. Okay. And I'll... You know, I'm glad Clarabelle brought that chair here, because those knock-knocks did make me a little tired. So while I'm waiting for Dilly, I just might as well sit down here for a minute. As howdy says, take a load off my feet. <laughs> take a... Ah! in the world is... What? It's not hot. Uh... Boy, I must be getting tired. Well, I'll still wait for Dilly. <laughs> what is with that chair? I... Clarabelle. That's a Clarabelle trick if I ever saw it. Clarabelle! Clarabelle Hornblow! I... Peanuts, excuse me, I'm gonna find that clown. Clarabelle! Whee! <laughs> Hi, Clarabelle! <laughs> Say, Buffalo Bob is looking for you. Oh, well, he'll be right back. Say, why don't you take a load off your feet while you're waiting for him? Good chair. There's nothing wrong with it. Man, everybody's been sitting in that chair. Go ahead. Try it again. Ah, there you are, you tricky clown. What's with that chair, Clarabelle? I... Now, look, of all the tricks you play, don't give me that innocent routine. I want you to sit in that chair. Come on. Uh-oh. Wiggle, waggle, turn it off. Clarabelle, I said, come over here now. Sit down. Sit down. What? Hey, Buffalo Bully Bob. Yeah. Why did you manhandle that poor, sweet clown? Well, because... Because I... Don't you feel anything? You don't feel anything at all? Something fishy's going on around here. Get up. I'm going to try this again, huh? Uh, wiggle, waggle, turn it on. You didn't feel anything. <laughs> well, I... <laughs> what? You... <laughs> I... What's the matter, Buffalo Bob? Did you sit on a tank? <laughs> no, but it sure felt like it. I... Peanuts, I'm going to need a few minutes to figure out the mystery of this chair. We'll be right back. Right after this. And things are real shocked, I know. Ho, ho. I think I can tell Sandra which cast to spell on a chair that makes people jump up and yell. Ho, 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 ho. You know, Dilly, this is kind of strange. When Clarabelle sat on it, nothing happened. When I sat on it, Well, yeah. Yeah, okay. 
Okay, Buffalo Bob. Yeah. yeah. But now I'm ready to sing my song. Oh, you're right, Dilly. It's time. Go right ahead and sing it, Dilly. Go. Okay. Yep, yep. Now, oh, now, golly, uh, but Buffalo Bob, aren't you going to sit down in the chair and listen to it? Well, I think not, Dilly. I think I'd just as soon stand right here. Oh, you know, well, Buffalo Bob, it's very distracting to I... have you standing here while I'm singing. Gosh, it makes me n -n -n nervous. Oh, really? Yeah. Now, won't you, uh, please, uh, sit down. Well, if you'd rather have me. All right, yeah. I'll, I'll risk it. I'll take a chance. Okay. Yeah. Now, uh, peanuts, uh, especially you young peanuts, I'm going to sing a song, and uh, I hope you'll, it'll be a good lesson for all of you, because it's all about... What? Bob, Golly, I... that, that, that chair is still acting up. Yeah, it's still a... Still acting up? Yeah. S you mean you know about it, too? Yeah, it happened to Jackie Davis. You... Oh. Look, you sing your song here. Yeah. I'm going to listen over there. Hey, uh, Jackie, buddy. Yes, what? Yep. How come you asked me to sit in that chair before when you knew all the time that the minute I sat in it, I was going to uh, go buzz? Uh, Buffalo Bob, look, it's time for Dilly Dolly to sing his song. Uh, I don't have time to talk to you now. Yeah, but I you mean, had already sat in that chair, and you knew when you asked me to sit in it. Buffalo Bob, that, we, Buffalo Bob, we got to play this song for Dilly Dolly, or the show will run late. No, that's uh, not Well, we're going to talk about this whole thing later. Go ahead, do the song. Just like you have watched a squirrel store his food away, every boy and every girl should save for a rainy day. So save your pennies, soon you'll have a nickel. Save your nickels, soon you'll have a dime. Save your dimes, and soon you'll have a quarter and a quarter on. Hey, say, where is everybody? Well, I guess they're backstage, huh? Well, I gotta put my boots on before I tap dance. I don't know how to tap dance. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> hey, help! Who help! Somebody left their boots out here, right in the middle of the arena. Wonder who'd do that? Well, I guess I'll just sit here and wait till that person comes back. I... Oh, well, hi, Happy. Oh, howdy. Um, I'm glad to see you. Are these boots yours? Well, gosh, no. Uh, could they be Buffalo Bob's? Well, I don't think so. But where is he? Well, Buffalo Bob is backstage. Matter of fact, he, he should be out here any minute. Any minute? Well, then in that case, I'll just sit here and wait for him, and then I'll ask him if he... Oh, what, what is it, Clarabelle? What? What? You... You, you say, you say strange things are happening. Strange things? What are you talking about? It's, what, this chair you're saying is haunted? Oh, come on, now that's ridiculous. Hey, hey. I can just... How are you? Hi, Buff, I just wanted to talk yeah, to you, too. Uh, now, the, do these boots belong to you? I just those? can't seem to find who no, they no, belong no, no, to. No, 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 those are oil well willies. Oh, yeah. they're oil well willies. Why? Well, they were just sitting here on the floor, and I tripped over them when I came oh, into the well, arena. Oh, well, I'll tell you what we'll do. I'll, uh, I'll take them back to Old Will Willie, okay? Okay. Come on, Howdy, and Clarabelle, uh, go with me, will you please? We'll look for Old Will Willie. Okay. Well, anyways, Peanuts, as I was going to say, we have a little... Oh! <laughs> Clarabelle was right there. I don't mean to say that the chair is haunted. I mean, because it wouldn't be haunted or anything, but it's not a normal chair. <laughs> No, <laughs> Peanuts, uh, I think I better get to the bottom of this, I mean, of this mystery. Whee! Hey, hey, kids, what do you want to see me about? 
Uh, oh, well, uh, Sandy, uh, we want you to remove your magic spell from that chair. <laughs> Forget it, Buster. What do you mean? No way! <sighs> well, what's tickling you? <laughs> well, Sandra, I'm just laughing because I think that that chair trick of yours is the funniest thing I've ever seen. I want to shake your hand. In your hand when you remove your magic spell from that chair. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Go ahead. Wiggle, wiggle. Turn it off. <laughs> wow! Where did you <laughs> learn that magic spell? Well, Sandra, it's just a regular old hand buzzer that you can find in any trick store. Oh, That's all wow. it was. You sure tricked me. Thank you. I'll Sandra. see you around. So long. Wait, wait so Sandra. Wait. Do not go yet. Oh. I want to make sure that you remove that spell from the chair, so I'm just going to test it, that's okay. all. Oh! <laughs> it was just my buzzer. I left it on the chair. <laughs> but, Sandra, that was not a howdy doody do. You mean, you mean that was a howdy doody don't? That's right. <laughs> Oh, do, do a howdy doody do. And don't do a howdy doody don't. Cause a howdy doody do will be good for you. But a howdy doody don't won't. That's right. How many howdy doody doers do we have? Let me see your hands. Nearly everybody. That's marvelous. All right, I have a little question for you, and I'd like to see what you think you should do to become a howdy doody doer. Now, let's suppose that your older brother or your older sister really disobeyed your parents. What would you do about it? Anybody? You. What, what, what would you do about it? I would snitch on him. <laughs> All right. How about you, Dolly? Stand up. What's your name? Elizabeth. Elizabeth. What would you do? Do you have an older brother? No, I have a younger one. Right, well, well, what if he did something wrong? What would you do about it? I'd either tell on him or I'd probably bargain with him that if he didn't do it again, I wouldn't tell on him. You know, I think that's a pretty, pretty good thing. That, I think, I think that would be called being a howdy doody doer, don't you? How many howdy doody doers in this section? Wow, that's terrific. Why don't you stand up? You look like a howdy doody doer. What have you done to make you? <laughs> well, when I, when, well, when my grandmother, when she's sick or something, when I help her, I do it right away and I don't. I don't pout when she asks me to do something. You know, that's a great way to have things done, not to pout about it and to do it right away. You do it. How about anybody else? You had your hand up. Let me hear about what you do. Uh, my friend in, the, in my backyard, they're making a little porch on the grass, and I help to bring the blocks where they're supposed to be. Well, that's terrific. And that's a new one, too. You both are howdy-doody-doers.